This is Mark Searles. He is the editor of Kotaku Australia and apparently an award-winning journalist. Yesterday, some completely public Facebook posts of his came to my attention. In them, he said, I've heard loads of different things though. I've heard women tell me that every time we talk to them slash about them, women suffer. That makes me want to do the oxygen deprivation thing. That really hit me actually to the point where I didn't want to address it at all. But I've also been told that men can't keep quiet, so I've tried the talking thing as well. I'm at the point where I just don't really know how to approach it. I just don't engage. They're desperate for legitimacy. I just try and deny them that. But it's such a massive grey area. The truth is, they're like fucking cockroaches. I feel like their impact has been reduced and they've lost all legitimacy. But that's just my own perspective. Really, I just want to physically fight them. What's this all about? It's time for a showdown. Things are gonna change now. It's you against me in the ring and right nobody gonna take me down! Oh! If that clip from 2011 is anything to go by, you misogynists should be quaking in your boots. But who is he actually talking about? I see people on Twitter saying, oh look, he's saying this about Gamergate or Gamergate supporters. There are certainly parallels with other tirades against Gamergate, but that's not who he's saying this about. Mark Searles, the editor of Kotaku Australia, has targeted this handful of individuals. But you might say, those people aren't in charge of Gamergate, they aren't leaders, they aren't representatives. They're just in charge of and responsible for Kotaku in action. The forum or subreddit. And you're correct, Mark Searles did not mention Gamergate. The post he responded to did not mention Gamergate. They are talking about Kotaku in action, which is not an amorphous blob you can just blame for anything. Kotaku in action is very formal. It has, as I said, moderators. It has people in charge. It has people responsible. It also has tens of thousands of subscribers who Mark Searles has publicly exclaimed he wishes to inflict physical violence upon. This is how the editor of Kotaku Australia responds to his critics. He's He's not saying this to vent about some amorphous boogeyman. He is saying this about Kotaku in action, a subreddit whose very name mocks the publication he works for. Let's look at this again. This stone-cold motherfucker put the message out to his journalist friends that women have told him that if you give any attention to this forum that mocks the publication he writes for, women suffer. Do you think he typed that with a straight face? These moments are rare and precious. You have just witnessed the response to Kotaku in action justifying its existence. But, as usual, that's just another one of my harmful opinions.